What's going on, everybody? It's Titanic C. Jack back at you. Today is release day for the Air Jordan Retro 6 Toro Bravo or Toro. Uh, I reserved my pair at DSG, they Sporting Goods, and I'm on my way to pick those guys up. And another reason I'm picking them up is I had $50 in DSG rewards, so it was almost a no-brainer. It actually was the deciding factor in me picking these up because I was kind of on the fence. Hey, do I need another red shoe? I have the fives. I have, also have the Toro fours. And I do have a lot of shoes that are black and red or red and black or generally majority red. So once I learned that I had that $50 all that big sport goods I went on the side to get these so I'm about to be pulling up in a couple minutes and uh, go inside and get these uh, Air Jordan Retro 6's so hit that like button for me leave a comment sub up if you haven't already and I'll see you when I come out of the store yes guys we walking out of big sporting goods Got them. The Jordan Sixes. Uh, I think they came to about one one sixty four after taxes. After I got that fifty dollars, so that was great. Uh, I seen them in hand already. Uh, over a month ago, the suede is really nice. In my opinion, I think the suede is better on these than the. Uh, the Raging Bull Fives on the feet today. Oh, I just got off work and went to the doctor office. I got those Nike Prestos on, so we gonna uh, roll out. Got a couple places to stop, and we gonna take a look at these once we get inside. Yes, guys, we've made it back to the spot. I brought y'all along with me. Pick up these bad boys right here. You see the box, the Air Jordan Retro 6, Toro Bravo, all red fold over box. Top, you got your Black Jordan Jumpman. Uh, this is the back side, Jumpman Air. Clean on this side. Here you go, Jumpman Air again right here. And you see your box, well, they got a tag right here. See that? And you see the box tag right here. This pair is for the tote. And it says Air Jordan 6 Retro Color Varsity Red and Black. Size 14 things. And the retail price was 200 bucks on them. But like I said earlier, I had $50 credit. $50. Count them. 50 And Dick Sporting Goods. So I got these for $150 plus tax. Uh, I think it came to like 163 and I show you that last stamp right here uh, The paper the splatter paper splat on one side white on the other And you do see that YCM sticker right there And that's everything that came in the box Okay, before we get into the shoot if you guys have been paying attention to my Instagram seen this uh post right here where I posted this box that we're shooting near the pack touchdown I'm gonna go ahead and open it show you guys what's inside uh, let's see got my box cutter right here that I've been having for a while probably need to change the blade in here as you can see it says premium shoe care I've had some close calls, but due to me prepping my shoes with the rejuvenated products, I dodged the bullet. Uh, particularly when I was down in uh, Orlando, I uh, spilled some orange juice on my uh, Raptor Force, but I hit it with some of this right here, the water and stain repellent. It just, the orange juice just beat it up and rolled off. Yep, we got a lot of tissues. 
box and you can uh take care of shoes like these the air jordan retro 6 toro bravo you can see that this shoe is majority suede or all suede i got my can right here and what you want to do shake it up make sure you're in a well there you go shake it up make sure you're in a well ventilated room and you hold the can about eight to ten inches away and you spray in the sweeping motion. You want to treat these shoes preferably before you wear them. You want to treat this entire sneaker because I do not want to mess these beauties up. There you go. We're going to let it dry for about 15 minutes. Later. Okay guys, 15 minutes have passed and these views have dried off. So we're going to get a, a quick look at them. You know, all suede on your upper. You can see you have your uh your 23 going on here. MJ on this side. Uh, you got a polyutherane midsole. You got your black hit, varsity red hit. You got your... Uh, translucent you got white underneath there and right here you got white underneath the translucent hit going around the air housing clear bubble you got the white inside gonna go to the outsole you see you got your jaw six outsole you got that translucent hit here voice the red jaw and jump man black you got like your golf ball looking holes and now i'm not sure why i got this dirt right here i haven't even tried these on Looking at your uh, heel of the sneaker, you got your uh, rear spoiler, I like to call it, because it reminds me of the spoiler on the Lamborghini Mike Loves, those racing cars. And you can see you have a, a Jumpman Air stitched on the heel, the back heel. Looking at the medial side of the sneaker, you got your uh, red, varsity red and black on that polyutherane midsole translucent with white underneath clear bubble again white on the inside give you guys a closer look at the suede me personally i think the suede on here is better than the suede on the uh toro bravo fives the raging bull fives i should say if you want to see a comparison video i need y'all to run these likes up I need at least 50 likes on this video if y'all want to see me do this comparison video for that. Comes with one set of laces. You got the Varsity Red Flat laces. You got your uh, pants that you have on sixes and nylon material. Also a nylon tongue. You got an embroidered Jordan Jumpman in red. You have a black push pin Varsity Red Jordan Jumpman right on here. And you do have your pull tab right there that says Air Jordan. Uh, let's see, can we look inside and get a look at that uh, sizing tag? Before we do that, come stuff with tissue. You got tissue in the uh, side of the shoe. Try to give you guys a look at that insert. Hold on, let me adjust my light. Get a good look inside. You see, you got a red Jordan Jumpman in there, and you got that sizing uh, sticker in there that says size 14. And you got a nice soft black sock liner. 
And let's see, can we read that uh, sizing tag? US size 14 production date is December 14th of 2022 to March the 1st, 2023. So, woo, about three and a half months of production with these. Get y'all to look. So let me know what y'all think. Did they sell out in your city? Uh, I didn't go look out in the city, but uh, I looked online. All the men's sizes sold out on sneakers and Nike. I've been seeing men's sizes pop up occasionally on different websites. So if you want this shoe for the toe, I suggest you pay attention to Twitter and all those sites that pop enough sneaker Twitter and get this sneaker for retail. Uh, I mean, before I go any further, the fit on these, true to size, I went true to size with these. They normally uh, fit pretty good with the uh, sixes, true to size, the way you should go, uh, in my opinion. I don't think there's room for you to size down, but uh, gray and school pairs on and smaller, all the way down or still sitting. You could probably walk into your local store, pick those up. If you want your kids to have a fresh pair of sneaks to go to those graduation parties because school is letting out now. So uh, this is what it is on the Air Jordan Retro 6 Toro Bravo. And we're going to end it right there. And before I go, like I always tell you guys, if you can help somebody get a sneaker, help them get that sneaker. Because you never know when it will be your turn to need help getting a sneaker. Titanic Feet Jack. Signing up.